ओके सो एवरीवन जॉइंड इलेवन अभी दो तीन लोग और ज्वाइन हो जाएंगे एंड विल स्टार्ट विद टूल्स All right. So we will continue. So what we should not do in the group discussion? First of all, in order to emerge as a successful candidate, you need to see. This is this is introduction. You just uh, I believe that the serious candidate is taking screenshot of every slide which we are discussing so that for his or her preparation. Chalo. What you should not have in the group discussion: distracted body language, right? Lack of interest. Okay, you should have that interest, right? Lack of interest. Dikh gaya. It goes into your. It doesn't go into your favor. Neither share views nor to open to contrary viewpoints. It means koi baat hi nahi kar raha hai. Kuch bhi nahi bol raha hai. You are not sharing anything in the group discussion. Cannot conclude or summarize point. Like if you are speaking, bas baat hi karte ja rahe ho. One, two, three, four, five. Just Beating around the bush, bush. It should not happen, right? Not having a progressive approach. What is the meaning of progressive approach? Is that you should have that. You know, up me, what need to be. You should have that. Uh, I will say intention to take the group discussion to the next level. Understand? Self-centered behavior. We have seen about what is the self-centered behavior and fail to involve others. Nervous. Talk very little. you should not nervous okay if you are nervous and speaking anything it will not go into your favors anxious to talk too much right so these are some negative traits which you should not have during the group discussion and one of the imp some important points are don't initiate the gd just for the sake of it if you don't have understanding of the topic don't risk it it will go in negative point about you agar initiate nahi kar pa rahe ho gd तर शहानपना करू नका डोंट डू एनी काइंड ऑफ सिलीनेस एंड टेक दैट ग्रुप डिस्कशन अगेंस्ट यू इफ यू डोंट नो एनीथिंग अबाउट द पॉइंट जस्ट लीव इट एंड लेट अदर्स डू द इनिशिएटिव एज आई सेड इनिशिएटिव इज सॉरी इनिशिएट द जीडी इफ ओनली यू हैव अ सफिशिएंट नॉलेज अबाउट दैट पर्टिकुलर टॉपिक डोंट अवॉइड आई कांटेक्ट विद अदर ग्रुप मेंबर्स नीचे नीचे देख के बात करोगे इधर उधर देख के बात करोगे सो व्हाट आई एम ट्राइंग टू से हियर ऐसा नहीं करना है हर एक के आंख में देख के बात करो डोंट लुक एट द जीटीओ व्हेन जीडी इज गोइंग ऑन नेवर लुक एट द जीटीओ ओके दिस इज द कंटिन्यूअस आई विल से एडवाइस गिवन बाय एवरी एसेसर इन द एसएसबी दैट डोंट डू नॉट लुक एट द एसेसर व्हाइल डूइंग एनी टेस्ट इन द एसएसबी ऑफ कोर्स ग्रुप इंटरव्यू में ऐसा नहीं चलेगा यू यू हैव टू लुक इनटू द फेस लुक इनटू आईज ऑफ इंटरव्यूइंग ऑफिसर डोंट गेट इमोशनल इन द जीडी everybody has different opinion about different things accept and understand don't lose your cool if any point is unacceptable to you use more facts figures and example to prove your point point but don't get emotional and hyper at least in the gd right the group discussion should have should be a group discussion it should not be the fight if somebody is not agree with you don't lose your emotions accept that point and use more fact and figures and examples to prove your points right don't make illogical morally unacceptable socially unacceptable sentences like commenting on any religion commenting on any particular region huh commenting on any particular society class of society don't talk like such that okay if you don't know about it don't speak about it you will lose your chance by doing it simply if you don't know about it don't speak about it कुछ भी बात नहीं करनी है एंड आई बिलीव द पर्सन द कैंडिडेट हु रीड एवरी डे विल हैव द पॉइंट ऑन एवरी टॉपिक एनी टॉपिक व्हिच विल कम इन फ्रंट ऑफ हिम और हर डोंट डोमिनेट अदर्स रिस्पेक्ट देयर ओपिनियन ये आई डोंट हैव टू एक्सप्लेन मच डोंट डेमोन्स्ट्रेट ईगो एक्सट्रीमिस्ट थॉट इन सिक्योरिटी द अल्टीमेट वे टू स्पीक इज स्पीकिंग बैलेंसिंग एंड फर्म सेंटेंसेस डू नॉट हेजिटेट वाइल speaking any topic ha huh? aapke andar wo ego nahi hona chahiye whenever you speak like if you have very good knowledge that's very good but to, you should not show that ego into your speaking be very polite firm and confident while speaking any topic understand this that do not try to be a moderator in gd ye ye sabse 
प्रॉब्लमेटिक चीज है डोंट ट्राई टू बी मॉडरेटर अरे चेस्ट नंबर थ्री लेट हिम स्पीक लेट देम स्पीक ओके लेट्स गो लेट्स टेक द ग्रुप डिस्कशन टू द नेक्स्ट लेवल नो अ लीडर कॉन्ट्रीब्यूट इन द जी डी क्वालिटेटिवली वट इज दीन मीन वट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ क्वालिटेटिव कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन इज दैट कॉन्ट्रीब्यूट एवरी टाइम विथ योर विथ मोर फैक्ट्स मोर फिगर्स विथ मोर लॉजिक विच विल टेक द ग्रुप डिस्कशन टू द नेक्स्ट लेवल मजा आ जाने चाहिए यार क्या पॉइंट बोल दिया इसने and this will automatically lead other candidates to accept your leadership you getting my point don't be in the impression that if i just moderate the gd i can sail through it don't be in that impression that i don't anything mai bas moderate kar lunga mere communication skill pe ye nahi chalega it never it's never like that content is what matters there is no single leader assigned to do the role of moderator in a gd for specific reason that all the candidates are competitors and all are expected to exhibit leadership qualities in some form of other each candidate is expected to join the discussion which means that you should show your leadership ability from inside gates right i always tell my students right avinash what is your sentence about the initiative chalo speak it speak to everyone avinash is there or not avinash yes sir what is it so jisme, when when we have the topic jisme kya the hai basic content samne aayega what is it uh, speak right at the right moment that one sir if you, you know we you know our dialogue right jisme kya hai aasha hai akanksha hai kya kya hai avinash speak it's your dialogue So I'm not able to recall at the moment. <laughs> right. जिसमें चाहत है आहत है आशा है मनीषा है आकांक्षा है प्रेरणा है what? Right? वो सामने आएगा and lead करेगा group को understand? And that person will come in front of everyone and lead the discussion. Right? The leader. This is the leaderless activity. There is no assigned leader here. So don't be the moderator. Be a leader here. Right? चलो. चलो next point. Don't argue with anybody do not personally target anyone to speak if you don't just jaise ki if you don't understand anybody's point anybody's uh if you don't agree with anybody don't just don't shout don't fight with anyone do not interrupt anyone while they are speaking of course interrupting ka matlab ye nahi hai ki bas wo bolte ja rahe ho aur aap apka chance nahi le rahe ho it means whenever he or she is giving the uh logical points then don't interrupt and the moment he or she starts speaking illogically simply interrupt politely and start with your point don't be over polite and don't nod at any point just for the sake of nodding ha huh? very important what is the meaning of this over polite ke chakkar mein sabka sun rahe ho yes bol rahe ho kuch bhi bol diya yes bol rahe ho ha huh? this should not happen don't use complex english language avoid using too long sentences and grammatically incorrect sentences which we have discussed don't use language other than english and if you go for hindi try to come to english as soon as possible we have discussed this point okay don't speak too fast and too slow it will lead to lose your track on the point and create bad impression what i'm trying to say here is you should uh, whatever your language na okay you should have the everybody have his or her own speed and follow that speed don't uh, for just sake of impression don't just you know speak uh, fastly you will lose track of thinking whatever your speed of thinking speak in that same speed that's why i i tell everyone that do loud reading exercise every day so that you will be able to uh, speak every time properly hmm? don't speak for just for the sake of speaking every word coming out of you is been assessed qualitatively so do not speak irrelevant do not repeat what has been said be very attentive and try to develop an ideal ideas expressed or give our give out new ideas what is the meaning of is just for the sake of speaking don't speak anything whatever you are speaking it should have quality quantity mein kam raho chalega but whatever you are speaking speak relevant speak qualitatively understand avoid not speaking at all means what you must speak in the group discussion hmm? as mentioned i'm sorry 
as mentioned before there are different roles you can do in the group and keep that in mind don't just speak and sit okay what are the roles you can do every time whenever the there is a track of the group discussion har track pe logic chahiye and that will be your role give that logic into that group do not do grammatical errors in the speaking we have seen this the point is repeated apology for this and this is the end because of uh, some problems i would i was unable to uh, make some interesting ppts here so if you have any doubt you can ask me just raise your hand and ask me the doubt if anybody have any doubt here uh, in the tomorrow session what i will do is i will present some of the group discussion topics and uh, we will see uh, we will i will just present four to five group discussion topic so that you will have an idea about the topics of group discussion and then immediately we will start with the uh, group planning exercise hmm? chalo anybody have any question ajay what is what is it by them or we have to choose the topic for the no the topic yes the process will be uh, first of all uh, gto sir will brief you about entire gto then he will uh, start with the group discussion activity in the group discussion activity uh, there will there will be two group discussions first in the first group discussions you will be given two topics and from those two topics you will have to discuss among yourself and choose one topic uh, democratically okay and once you choose that topic you will have to discuss on that topic in second group discussion a compulsory topic will be given by the gto sir which you will have to discuss on it understand and so in such a manner two group discussions will occur understand sir and sir if we don't have knowledge about that topic then what we should be our... if you don't have knowledge don't speak simply and it won't happen that you don't have that knowledge about that topic okay don't worry about it you know any something you know something about that no don't worry hmm? and uh, the, the topic won't be like kisi ko koi knowledge hi nahi rahega ha chalo who is it uh, who is this most must i don't know the name what is your name surender sir surender okay surender ask your question that question i already asked by someone sir <laughs> okay okay sure so uh, lavina no, is ask okay yeah Lavina is asking question. If I disagree with the candidate, how to convey it? Uh, see, uh, generally the topic are in such a manner that you have you are given three topics, and if you are not agree with that particular person, uh, you can simply say that uh, I have some different view about this point, just number three. Uh, and if you think that that person has given a wrong or factually incorrect uh, sentence, so I would like to correct your point that this is not the fact. This is the fact. So, आपका डिसमेंट एक तो फैक्ट के ऊपर होगा या फिर किसी के ओपिनियन के ऊपर होगा सो इफ ओपिनियन के बारे में आप डिसग्री कर रहे हो इफ यू आर डिसग्रिंग अबाउट ओपिनियन जस्ट इफ यू आर डिसग्री अबाउट द ओपिनियन यू कैन सिंपली से दैट जस्ट नंबर फोर आई डोंट थिंक आई एम आई एम नॉट एग्री विथ यूर पॉइंट बिकॉज एंड देन गिव यूर जस्टिफिकेशन इफ यू आर नॉट एग्री विथ एनी बडी गिव द प्रॉपर एंड लॉजिकल जस्टिफिकेशन ओके चलो अविनाश गो विथ योर क्वेश्चन सर व्हेन वी प्रोसीड फॉर द ग्रुप डिस्कशन मोस्टली द डिस्कशन टॉपिक इज डिवाइडेड इनटू थ्री बेसिक पिलर्स लाइक व्हिच कैन बी द मेन रीजन फॉर दैट कॉज ओके सो इफ आई एम सपोर्टिंग वन पॉइंट लाइक इकोनॉमिकली आई एम सपोर्टिंग अ पॉइंट दैट यस इकोनॉमिकली इट इज द कॉज एंड द अदर पर्सन इज सपोर्टिंग पॉलिटिकल कॉज सो इफ टू डिफरेंट लेग्स दे आर फॉर दैट सेम कॉज so it uh, so there is no contraction like how we can compare two different things like i am talking about economic he, he is talking about political so there is no contrast in views because the base is different for both the things so you have to prove uh, your point like why economy is see of course every point have three pillars you cannot say that because of only this pillar that particular topic is uh, you know existing understand so you are saying that if i choose one part, if i choose one side then i know that other two sides are also equally right but 
as you have chose that side you have already chosen that side you have to give more relevance and more logic and more facts and more figures that why my point is important it is not that why your point is not important it is that why my point is important understand so sir along while yeah. discussion uh, when yeah. we do the discussion along with giving points to support our point we yeah. should also know the points uh, like where their supportive topic is like comes after our priority like i'm i'm not getting topic. your question i'm not getting your question so like we we have supported economically uh, it is the cause for corona if we support mm -hmm. okay so we uh, initially what we do we add points how economically it is the reason mm -hmm. if someone is having the political cause mm -hmm. and he is supporting it so we should also know the negative like whether he is speaking true or no that is not the cause uh, yes, politically yes. also we should know how the role is played yes 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 okay so you, you want to contradict you want to oppose the political point right so yes your point is economical no so in the opposite yes. to that political point you should you should tell that why opposite to it economical point is important <laughs> understand why opposite to yes. for example for example you are you are saying that uh, somebody is saying that uh, somebody politically will say that because of uh, not giving proper attention the covid situation spiked right so you are supporting yes, the economical sir. point understand yes sir so uh, you want to contradict that point right so you will be saying you will say that but as economy is not uh, in the pro economy is not flourishing as indian economy is already uh, in the downfall the government have lack of funds and because of that it is happening not because only the political because of political point understand so in order to contradict his or her point you should give your point you should give your point of view understand yes sir so like my main uh, query was along with positives of our point we should know the negatives of their point yes, like yes. what they are stating in order should, to counter yes yes you should know negative of their points and why that negativity can be uh, covered by why that negativity can be justified with your points samajh rahe ho to matlab government ka dhyan nahi hai kyun nahi wo bole ki government ka dhyan hai aapko lagta hai ki government ka dhyan nahi hai right तो गवर्नमेंट इफ यू वांट टू स्पीक गवर्नमेंट का ध्यान नहीं है देन यू विल स्पीक इकोनॉमिकली दैट गवर्नमेंट इज नॉट फोकसिंग ऑन द इकोनॉमिकल डेवलपमेंट एंड दैट इज व्हाई गवर्नमेंट इज फेसिंग प्रॉब्लम अंडरस्टैंड यस ओके चलो यस सुरेंद्र सुरेंद्र राइट यस सर सर सपोज इनिशियली सपोर्टिंग ऑन वन टॉपिक सॉरी दैट मींस वन पॉइंट Initially okay. supporting uh, one. Please, please speak Anil. again. Please speak again. Yeah, initially supporting one point. Mm -hmm. So in between, he is supporting other point. Can you do that? No, 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 no. Don't do this. Don't do that. Synthesize properly in your mind. Decide which point you want to support, and then support that point only. Don't do that. Hmm. Ah, okay, sir. Okay. So anybody have other question? किसी और को क्वेश्चन है चलो शर्मा हूं मत यार क्या ये दोस्तों के साथ तो एक एक घंटा बात करते हो आप कृष्णा सॉरी इनिशियल स्लाइड्स विच वन दिस वन नो सर अगेन बैक इज बैक दिस वन यस थैंक यू ओके ओके चलो किसी को डाउट है लविना यू हैव एनी डाउट अजय अविनाश ने पूछ लिया प्रभात रमा देवी विजय किसी को कोई डाउट क्लियर करवा लो चलो आई गेस नो बडी हैव एनी डाउट चलो फाइन थैंक यू एवरीवन some of our candidates are asking for the okay lavina has they have a doubt while concluding gd we have to consider the point of all the candidates or just the relevant ones uh, generally jo points zyada uh, the points which are you know, effective uh, generally you don't have to conclude actually huh? if uh, gd uh, if but if you really want to if you really have to conclude then pick pick important points about each uh, aspects of the gd 
for example uh, what are the points uh, necessary what how india will be developed economically socially or environmentally so the one who has two points about environment two points about, about economic and two points about society and then that will be your summer, summary okay and any topic everyone understand any topic can be divided into economic soci social and environmental aspect give me any topic and i can give you demonstration that we can divide this topic economically socially and environmentally do you want to give any topic for that excuse me sir ah huh. sir while discussing uh -huh. let others point are more uh, more convincing can we switch to them no 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 i think uh, i think the one of one of the candidate have already asked this question no 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 you can't switch whatever you have decided with jiske sath jis point ke sath jana hai go with that point only hmm? thank you chalo fine uh, i don't think i think nobody has uh, has any topic so that i can divide a particular topic in social economical and environment thing chalo fine uh, we will see you tomorrow a lot of candidates are asking that we should have the morning session how many of you are agree for morning early morning session before 8 or 9 am how many of you are agree on this one avinash 2 3 ajay at 9 okay lavina is also agree Vijay Kumar is agree. Madhav, Prabhat, Prabhat. This time is best. Actually, lot of uh, most of more candidates have other uh, classes, online classes, Prabhat, and some of them are doing work from home. So there is problem about their attendance. So what we will do is tomorrow we will do uh, we will do uh, on the same time like seven. So, so tell me one thing: six thirty is okay or seven is okay? Because since we have started class on six thirty, the attendance has declined. First, tell me that. Then we will decide about the seven. Okay, seven. Avinash is saying seven. Ajay six thirty. Prabhat eight. Okay. So okay. So what we will do is tomorrow we will uh, do the discussion on the same time. Okay, seven. So six forty five. We will start. Kar denge. Okay. या सिक्स थर्टी को ही स्टार्ट कर देंगे टुमारो वी विल डू इट एट सिक्स थर्टी एंड फ्रॉम डे आफ्टर टुमारो आई वी विल डिस्कस एंड डिसाइड द टाइम फॉर द मॉर्निंग सेशन एंड फ्रॉम डे आफ्टर टुमारो वी विल डू मॉर्निंग सेशन सो दैट आप दिन भर के लिए फ्री हो जाओगे फॉर योर प्रैक्टिस एग्री एवरी वन चलो एवरी वन एग्री यस चलो फाइन फाइन चलो थैंक यू फॉर थैंक यू एवरी वन फॉर द डिस्क फॉर दी फॉर अटेंडिंग द लेक्चर आई विल सी यू टुमारो गुड नाइट एवरी वन टेक केयर टेक रेस्ट बाय बाय